Adrian Silva moved to his Monaco in the January transfer window after a difficult period at Leicester City. His father made it clear when speaking to the Portuguese media that the family felt Claude Puel had been messing the player about. There was even a suggestion it was personal and that Puel would be irritated if Silva got a move to France, with Bordeaux very keen at the time. In the end he was recruited by Leonardo Jardim, with it being made clear in France that the Monaco manager believes in him and much preferred the prospect of having the Leicester player for the rest of the season than Yairi T. Elmans. So T. Elmans was sent to the Foxes and Silva wakes up in Monaco today to nice spring-style temperatures, sunshine all day, we checked for our pain, a light breeze and no risk of showers. and he'll be getting football. But what about the money? Well, Friday's edition of Lequip has a rundown on League One wages, and whilst they don't make it absolutely clear which club is paying what in the Silva T. Elman's loan swap, they do give a very good idea. It's explained Silva was thought to be earning €2 million Euros a year after tax in England. That's usually worked out at half the gross figure, even though footballers find ways not to pay 50% tax. So the 4 million euros would roughly match the 4 million pounds figure sometimes reported in England. T. Elmans was earning 1 euro. 6 meters gross per month in Monaco, so 1.6 million euros after tax as well, given there's no income tax there. That's 1.92 million euros, roughly the same figure as Silva. However, it stated Monaco won't be paying Silva's salary, with the only option left being that Leicester are. So each club continues paying the same way they were.